I'm Marvin Pierce, dog teacher, and we're here with hot Cassie. Good girl, come here. Cassie, hot. Good girl, come here. Good girl. Blue. Oh, he got pee on my barrel. So we're here with two pet bulls that got in a couple of pretty bad dog fights, and that's why they're here. I, come here, Blue. This is Blue. Cassie. She's going to the bathroom now. But they're here because they got in a, a bad dog fight at home. And uh, I think Cassie had to get sewed up. Come here, Cass. Come here, Blue. Blue. Hot Blue. No. Come here. Blue. Good boy. Blue. Trying to get him to get in the picture. Hot. He wants in the camera, on the camera. Come here, buddy. Good boy. But these two got in a bad dog fight or two at home. And it goes back to me. I feel the reason being is they had Blue, who was like five years old or six year old pet bull, for I think forever. And then they got Cassie, who's a pup. She's, I think, 20 months old now. They brought her home, and Blue's like, you know, I'm kind of boss of the house, and I get to growl a little bit, and Cassie'd be like, okay, I don't want to argue with you. Well, my philosophy on it all is I feel and I always stand behind it because of the fact that ah, Cassie's Cassie over there sniffing on the camera crew again. But I feel what happened is she aggravates Blue and Blue asks her to quit, but she doesn't want to quit. She wants to keep on. And so Blue says, okay, nobody in the house is going to make you quit, so I'm going to have to step up and do it myself. So he tries to make her quit. Then we end up with a dog fight. And, well, will you step in here? We end up with a dog fight. And it's not that either one of them wanted to fight. Here, come over here. See if you can get the dogs to come over here. Will you come in too? I'd like to get them in a picture some. Good dogs. Yeah, don't put a leash on them. Just let them come over and aggravate. But I still feel that the reason that these dogs got in a fight was because they didn't make Blue uh, they didn't, he didn't understand that he was not the boss in the house, and the little pup got to playing too hard. Get him over here, please. Get him over here. Hot! Hot! Good. It's like, hot! Like there, they start playing too hard. Hot! No. Good. Hot! Good. They start playing too hard, and like I said, Blue's an older dog. So he, whenever he has enough, he wants it to stop. And cats don't want to stop. There's nobody there to stop it. For me, I just stopped it. I swatted cats on the butt because she was an instigator in my opinion. And they just quit. And now they're done with it. Will they go back to it? For sure. But not bad. Me, <clears throat> my whole philosophy of all of this is for me to fix a dog, they had to make a mistake. I got them to make a mistake so I could make them a better dog. And that's, for the owners of these dogs, when that happens, they're traumatized because they see a dog fight coming on. Where <clears throat> me, it's like, cool, I see an opportunity to prevent a dog fight. And it's like, here, they want to play again. Blue's like, no, he walked off. And Hunter called Cassie back over here, and Cassie's like, well, I'll just come over and hang out with you. But that's what Cassie needs to learn. She needs to learn just to chill out. So we're going to uh, stop the video here. Do you have any comments you'd like to add? No, I agree with everything you said. Good. And I pay her to say it. <laughs>